Hey guys, welcome back to Eileen Vibe Cooking. Today we're making this super easy ooey gooey peach cobbler. So easy. I'm going to show you guys how it's done. Be sure to like it if you enjoy it. Subscribe if you're new. Without further ado, let's jump right into it. Right, this is what you need to make this super easy peach gobbler here I have salt I have cornstarch ground cinnamon ground nutmeg pure vanilla extract I have one can of peaches self rising flour sugar unsalted butter and yeah this is what you need basically to make this I'm adding about one stick of butter in here then I'm going to pop it in the oven so I can melt it and also that will make the baking pan that I'm baking it in nice and hot when I pour my batter in there it'll be nice and hot ready for this peach cobbler now let's make our batter. I am going to pour one cup of the self-rising flour in here and also one cup of sugar. You can also do half and half brown sugar with regular sugar. Now I'm going to add one cup of cold milk. All right, I'm using whole milk, but it has to be cold. Just pour that in and stir it, mix it together. Now I am going to pour my peaches right in here. Then we're going to start adding all the ingredients in there. I'm using one teaspoon of cinnamon and about a quarter teaspoon nutmeg, a teaspoon of vanilla extract, and a little bit of salt. I'll say a little bit under a quarter teaspoon of salt. All right, and also I'm adding one tablespoon of cornstarch in there that will make it nice and thick all right we're going to stir it together to make sure um, we don't have any lump with the cornstarch stir it together until you have something like this now I'm going to take my batter and just pour it right into the butter just most of the batter, all right? I save a little bit for later. Now I'm going to add the peaches right in. Now I'm going to add the rest of the batter right on top, just like that. Now once you're done, you're going to mix a little bit of sugar with cinnamon and just sprinkle it right on top of it. If you don't like that much cinnamon, you can just use a little bit, but it's nice. It gives it a nice flavor. I'm going to bake this on 350 for 50 minutes. Once it's done, ooh, you should have something like this. Super ooey gooey. <laughs> Super ooey gooey peach cobbler classic recipe. You cannot go wrong. Just follow the, the measurement and it will come out exactly like this. All you need now is some ice cream, and then you're good to go. Before you serve it, make sure to let it sit for about 15 minutes, all right? And this is the recipe, quick and easy, super easy. 
peach cobbler hope you enjoy it hope you like it if you did enjoy it be sure to give a like share with your friends and also subscribe if you're new thank you for watching guys i'll see you guys tomorrow in another video bye